Welcome back. We are here on Etro looking at the cryptocurrency market. And this is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, October 27, 2020. If you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. So we'll start by looking at Bitcoin, then to look at Ethereum. And as you can see, Bitcoin has broken above 13 13,000 uh, level and at this point we're definitely just waiting for this market to fall again um, not to burst to bubble but we are significantly overbought at this point this doesn't mean that we'll not go higher with Bitcoin but at this point it is not a buying opportunity because we are significantly overbought we're at 76 um at this point and we may trade sideways for um a while and the reason why i say that is because the macd is still quite far away from the signal line but when we cross the signal line that is going to be an indication that this market is going to trade uh, lower towards the 50 moving average i'm not a seller in this market but due to the fact that we are in a um, uptrend and there's no reason to be a seller in this market. We have a, um, a support line here, an upward tra trend line, and that will act as extra um, support uh, for this market. Uh, if we fall to, uh, down from here, then of course the 50 moving average will be significant um, support and if we fall even further, then this trend line will be significant support. Um, to the upside, we have, of course, crossed or and have are trading now above thirteen thousand. Um, and the next significant resistance should be at thirteen thousand seven hundred and ninety-one. But I don't believe that we're going there at this point. We need a pullback towards the fifty moving average. Uh, before we go higher if you look at technical indicators macd is still uh, quite far away from the signal line so it will take a few trading days um, probably one or two uh, more trading days in order to this uh, macd to cross the signal line stochastic is basically on the signal line at the moment but it is going to go uh, down uh, the CCI is showing signs of weakness and uh, the um, RSI is showing that we are significantly overbought. So expect a pullback, but that is basically a buying opportunity in order to enter this market. Uh, we can see that this area here at 11,500, 11,400 will also act as uh, significant support. So if you look at Ethereum. We can see that we have started to break down from, from our previous highs of 420. And now we're heading towards the 50 moving average. Um, we should find quite a lot of support within this area of 360. Uh, and of course, also the 50 moving average. A break below the 50 moving average opens the door to 330 and then to 309 of course we'll have the 200 moving average acting as support as well but i do believe that we'll go towards the 50 moving average and then bounce from there we are still in a, in an uptrend we have similar to bitcoin a trend line here which will act as a support if we um, break below the 50 moving average if we bounce from here, then we'll find resistance at 414, we'll find resistance at 444, and we'll also find resistance at 485. Technical indicators for, for this market are looking very bearish at this point. MACD is about to cross the single line. Stochastic is showing signs of weakness or bearishness. The same goes with the CCI and uh, the RSI is technically flat at this point. So pull back towards the 50 moving average. If we bounce from here, then that is a sign that we are about to go higher. So hope you find this video helpful. 
You're welcome to support the channel by hitting the subscribe button down here in the corner, hitting the bell button and the like button in order to see our newest videos. Good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.